What is going on YouTube? Brad Vapes here, back for another e-liquid review, and this one is on a e-liquid called Banana Ice Cream by Drip Drop Vapor. And before I go on to talk about anything, I'm just going to mention these are some of the best bottles that I've ever used. Um, they're so easy to shove in your pocket, they're a nice size to drip with, they're just, it's like writing with a pen when you drip and you can just squeeze it like that, it's just very comfortable. Childproof lids, they come off easily enough, but not too easy that a child would be able to get into them. Only con, the labels are a cheap, sort of sticky paper. Um, so my labels are starting to rub off a little bit on some of them, but um, that's not a problem for me. They're just starting to crack and stuff, but they have got all the right triangular stickers and stuff on there. And there will be a close-up on screen of that bottle now, just a little pan of it, just so you can see the whole thing. Uh, but yeah, as you can see, it's a very cool bottle. Um, and yeah, so I'm going to mention this flavour. Um, banana ice cream, it's not what I expected, but uh, we'll talk about that in a moment. Um, they are 60 VG and 40 PG mixes, but I did request a 80 PG and 20, no, an 80 VG and 20 PG opposed to the 60 VG, um, which is good that you can request your own nicotine levels, uh, your own PG VG levels, sorry, and the nicotine goes from 0, 3, 6, 9, 12, and 18 milligrams, um, and it's five pound including postage for a 30 mil bottle. So uh, that is some cheap, cheap, cheap liquids. And sorry, the uh, camera's getting a bit too bright there. Um, but yeah, let's just go to vape. I'll talk about what I mean about the flavour. Uh, do excuse me, I pardon myself. Um, but yeah, so this is banana ice cream. And honestly, what I was expecting was a uh, maybe a vanilla, vanilla banana flavour. Maybe something like that. But uh, that's not what you get at all. But I'll quickly vape and then I'll tell you about it just so you can see the, uh, the beta production. And this is a 0 0.2 ohm dual macro coil. Um, it is six wraps of 0 0.6 millimeter canthal around a three millimeter drill bit. Comes out around four point, uh, 0 0.2 ohms, and I'm running this at 73 watts, which is 4.2 volts. So let's see how it vapes. And this is on the uh, Derringer, or the Derringer, or whatever you want to call it. So you can see it's producing plenty of vapour, so uh, obviously if you're buying these, the company is called Drip Drop, so I'm guessing it's all for dripping. Um, so if you're going to be dripping, you're going to be going for big clouds. Um, and this is producing big clouds, um, especially with the setup that I've got going on, but obviously your vapour production will all differ depending on your build, your airflow, your voltage, all that sort of stuff. But yeah, the flavour, I gave my friend a try of it because I couldn't quite figure out what the banana flavour was, but he got it spot on. And it's sort of like them dry banana bits you get in cereals. Um, you know, like the dry bits of banana you get in them healthy oaty cereals. It tastes like that, um, which isn't a bad thing. It does taste like a really, it's not a natural banana. It's got a bit of that sweet foam banana flavour. But it's more of a sort of authentic, natural sort of banana flavour. But there's no vanilla in there. There's nothing like that, not to me anyways. What I am getting is banana, and rather than it being ice cream, it's more like banana ice. So rather than it being vanilla -y, like ice cream, you're actually getting a cold feel. It's obviously got menthol in there. But um, it feels cold, which is really bizarre, with banana especially. But um, it is cold like ice cream. So it's actually like you're eating some ice cream because you're getting that banana. But then you're getting the cool on your tongue and on your throat. So opposed to a banana vanilla flavor, sorry, you're actually getting a cold banana. So it's actually like eating ice cream opposed to the flavors of ice cream. And if you haven't already seen it, my Vimto review, I talk about how I like the different feeling of the vape that you get from it, because you get a fizzy feeling on your tongue. Um, but with this, obviously you get that cold feeling, and it's just, it's your regular, like, menthol crystal flavour, uh, feeling, sorry. But um, just because of, like, the concept of it, because it's meant to be ice cream, for some reason, I find it a lot more exciting than I probably should. Um, but even better, because the flavour itself is actually a really, really nice flavour. Um... This is one which, if you're into your bananas, I'd recommend giving it a try. If you like your menthols, well, your menthol feels, if you like your cold vapes, then uh, definitely give this one a try as well, because it is a, uh, it's an interesting one. But the flavour itself is really nice, and for £5, I really don't think you can go wrong. Um, but yeah, that's all I've got to say. Um, I hope you enjoyed this review. Don't forget to leave a like if you liked, leave a comment if you've got anything to ask or say. Subscribe if you haven't already. And yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video, and I will see you guys later.